Mosier can capture multiple layers within the same measurement. Each layer is aligned using a shared origin point and a repeatable A to B reference edge. This ensures that every layer is placed correctly in three-dimensional space, whether it's a raised platform, a sunken surface, or a separate area nearby. Start by tapping the plus icon and selecting your measurement type. You'll begin by establishing a reference edge, a repeatable A to B line that helps align all additional layers. This can be done in one of two ways. By beginning your perimeter measurement with a clear repeatable A to B segment, your first two points, or by creating a standalone A to B line beforehand. This A to B segment can follow any path type, but for best accuracy, we recommend using a longer, more defined edge. Walk between two memorable points, keeping in mind pace, placement, and rotation, ideally along a visible feature like a fence or path edge. To make it easier to return to these points when adding new layers, consider marking them with something visible like a cone, flag, or chalk mark. Once you've completed your first shape, tap the Layers icon in the bottom right corner and select Add Layer. You'll now recapture your reference edge to align the new layer. First, return to your shared origin point, point A. The app will display a black dot at this location. After capturing that point, you'll be prompted to walk to a second point along your original A to B edge. As you do, the app draws a black line between points A and B, helping you visually confirm your alignment with the original reference edge. You don't need to match the exact second point from your first measurement, just ensure it's on the same line. Mosher will then automatically switch to the ignore line path. This means it continues tracking your movement in 3D space without placing any points, allowing you to walk freely to your next area. Once you arrive at the layer edge you want to capture, select the appropriate path type and measure your next shape as usual. Repeat this process for each additional layer, always starting from your shared origin and realigning with your A to B reference edge. Each time you add a layer, Mosher automatically calculates the area and perimeter. Once you have saved your measurement, tap the layers icon to view a full breakdown. From here, you can see the area and perimeter for each shape toggle layers on and off using the eye icon and rename, export or delete individual layers using the three dot menu. You can also tap on area calculator at the top of the screen to view the total combined area of your visible layers. From here you'll see your layers listed in two sections, added layers and subtracted layers. You can drag and drop layers between these sections or tap the arrow icons to move them. The app will automatically update the net area at the bottom of the screen based on what's included in each section. Use the eye icons to quickly show or hide individual layers in the calculation. To help visualize complex projects, each new layer is automatically shown in black by default, but you can assign a different color to each one for clarity. To change a layer's color, tap the icon with the black circle next to the layer name and choose your preferred color. This makes it easier to distinguish between shapes or surfaces at a glance. If you need any extra help with anything shown in this video, just send a support request directly within the app. A member of the Mosher team will be happy to provide personalized support.